Okay, so we're live, Squirrel. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it looks like we have a decent view. Gotta be Jean! Yes, sir. We've got Squirrel over here. <laughs> she got a big bump on her leg. How long have you had this? I this is the uh, left anterior thigh. Yeah, it's been it's been several years, I, but I've just noticed that it has mm -hmm. expanded in the last probably three to four mm -hmm. years. Mm -hmm. Do you eat a lot of raw pork? A raw pork? I try to steer I steer away from that. Okay, all right, good. Just making sure. <laughs> So uh, we've already kind of, you know, this this is a simple procedure. And so what we're going to do is we're going to make a little incision here. We're going to run vertically. That's your preference. I told you we can go mm -hmm. horizontally or vertically. You chose vertical. Um, we try to go in the same direction as there might be any wrinkle lines in the future to help obscure the, the scar. So um, we've, we've kind of uh, used a little betadine here and, and alcohol and gummy jeans going to spray the cold spray. And uh, then I'm going to inject you with the, the uh, house cocktail. Here. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. All right. How's that sound? You ready? I'm ready. Let's All do right. it. Burr. Ooh. Okay, squirrel. You ready? I'm ready. What's she going to feel, Gummy Jane? Stick sting and a burr. Okay. Right. Stick. Yeah, we do. That's a bleb right there. You got a nice bleb. So what have you been doing yourself during, uh, with yourself during the uh, the pandemic? Oh, well, we have our kids at home. Yeah. So school, virtual learning is... So we're doing distance learning from home, right? Yes. You can't say homeschooling, it's school from home. Right, it, there's, yeah. There's, it's a not home, there's a big difference, which yeah, I true. admire those who can do that. But my I have two special needs children. Do you? So okay. They, everything goes in their mouth, so that we figured it was really? probably okay. best to keep them home. They will not wear a mask, of course. They won't do it, huh? So we're just... It, it's, we're having fun with it. it we've actually got a, you know, got mm -hmm. the hang of it. But man, teachers, I don't, they I don't know how they're doing right it. Yeah. They already had their hands full to begin with, and now mm -hmm. doing double duty. I have a lot of teachers that we've had in that we've mm -hmm. kind of been working with. Some of them really had some chronic medical problems and didn't feel like they'd be safe going back to work. Yeah. So we helped them you know, kind of get exemptions from that. And then we've had others that, that did want to go back to work. In fact, a lot that were, uh, yeah. no, that, um, you know, treat uh, special needs children, yes. as a matter of fact. And um, they wanted to work, so we, you know, we helped yeah. them uh, medically to, oh, to deal with their anxiety and other issues. I'm gonna set this right here. We're gonna let this anesthetic kind of work for a few minutes before we make the incision, okay? okay. And then we'll be right back. Okay. Well, I guess we can get started. What do you think? Okay, as long yeah. as we're numb, I'm good. So you've had this little bump for a couple of years. It's been, yeah, it's been several years. It's very rubbery. We think this is a lipoma, but we'll know here in a moment, won't okay. we? We're gonna make an incision with a 15 blade. Okay. You should feel that pressure, like you talked about, right? Oh, something just hurt. Oh, that, oh my goodness. Oh, oh. It fooled us. Uh -oh. It fooled us. What? It's not a lipoma. Oh, what is it? It's an epidermoid cyst. That's a really it unusual a place to get an epidermoid cyst. Okay. And we know because it's it's, uh, it's actually uh, self-expressing right now. Okay. Thank yeah, so I didn't feel anything. You're going to see it on the video. Is it showing up pretty good on the yeah, video okay. for you? Yeah, she wanted to see this. We weren't going to video with us at first. I'm glad like, we did. I want a video. I want to see it. Yeah. It's one of the, that's the only thing I knew to call with yeah. this. Yeah, so know. we'll go ahead and just empty this. Okay, that'd be great. There we go. Whoa. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> now, that's bad when you're both going well. Well, that was, it was just exciting. We like this. We, okay, good. Yeah. Now, is this something that... Will probably come back. What should no, I expect? I'm gonna try my best to make sure it doesn't come back okay, by, that'd be by great. dissecting out the the sac. Mm -hmm. Now, if this was a lipoma, there wouldn't be a sac, oh, okay. right? If we just remove the lipoma, in which it felt like a lipoma, and that's why you never really know. You can you you, you can think you know, right? <laughs> but you don't really know so you until you get in there. Take that bottle. Thanks. It is good. I like that. We don't want you to feel any pain. Whoa. I can't believe how deep that is. Oh my God. <laughs> I can't even see it. I'm just going by your reaction. I wasn't expecting that. You weren't expecting that one, were you? <laughs> Maybe I don't want to watch it. <laughs> no. Now I have to. Yeah, you oh, have to watch it. You're going to want to watch this one. This is really worth watching. So you feeling that pressure? I'm feeling the pressure just from you pushing down on me, but yeah. not like, you know, like you would have pushed it down my thigh at all, you know? Right. We definitely want to empty this, and then we're going to get on the, get working on the sack here. Sack. <laughs> <laughs> One of those words. <laughs> yeah, you were telling a whole bunch of good stories a few minutes ago. <laughs> I'm trying to be quiet. No, 
no, no, there's no need for that. <laughs> We don't want quiet. We don't want quiet. We want, we want to hear your chatter. <laughs> we want to hear your opinions. Tell us about the election. What do yeah, you think? Yeah, let's, let's get into that. Tell us about your opinions on the election. <laughs> don't take your mind off of this. I'm ready for everything. We'll just bleep out the <laughs> Yeah. And so, beep, so. Beep, beep, beep. Uh, My biggest concern right now, though, is that... You know, the election really hasn't been decided. That's that's what I mean. I'm just, I'm ready. Let's, let's move yeah. forward. As a country, let's go. <laughs> you know? I, Whichever I, way that is, let's, can we just move forward together? There's the old gain-loss theory. If you give somebody something and then you take it away from them, then they get really upset. <laughs> and if a lot of people right now who think that their side won find out later that they didn't, they're going to be very upset. Now, I'm not going to make a prediction here. All I'm saying is it ain't over. I mean, the counting's not over. fat lady sing. That's right. Now, Gubby that's Jane, that's insane. just mean. Well, I'm sorry. We didn't say who, but we. <laughs> she said fat lady, though. <laughs> I did. Not the action. I'm big sis, though. Yeah. It sometimes. seemed like it was all solid. Like I, like you said, I figured it, felt it just rubbery. popped out yeah, it felt, like it, as one. Definitely felt rubbery and solid. No <laughs> question about that. <laughs> Nice ass set. It is. Coming right out. Didn't even need a laser, did I, Gummy Jean? No. There we go. That won't slip off. Yeah, we usually don't see these in the anterior aspect of the thigh. We see them hmm. um, on the back. You so know. So is that probably what I have in the just the back, same thing, or? No, what you had on your back was just a regular benign neoplasm or a mole, okay? That's, that's. Even the above one? The one above was different. Now, okay. the one on your, uh, but your it's other not... leg is a, probably a small epidermoid cyst as well. Okay. Okay. Because they're not expanding as much as this one did. That whole sack is right there, Gummy yeah. Jane. Look at that. I think that's one pretty big. Yeah, right there it is. Now, will I be sore later? You got the whole sack there. It's sure the sack. Huh? There it is. <laughs> I see it. Your little face. I see it. Looks like a big old tick, doesn't it? <laughs> All right. Thanks for tuning in to Dr. Gilmore. Don't forget to support your health and our channel by checking out Meta7 for energy and immune system health. See the link below. Oh, that, oh my goodness. Oh. Oh. It fooled us. Oh, it, did. Uh -oh. it fooled us. What? It's not a lipoma. Oh what is it? It's an epidermoid cyst. That's a really it unusual a place to get an epidermoid cyst. Oh. So we're all clear. We just need a little flush, please, ma'am. Are you going to find clean. out the sex of the baby? I already know. I found out at 11 weeks. What? Through the chromosome test. Oh, okay. Uh, they that's ask crazy. if you want to do the, the sex. Okay, that one I'm feeling. Oh. Yeah, that's just a little fluid. It's gonna come right back out, bubble up. It's just stinging. Is what yeah, I feel. a little sting there. Yeah. We're, we're we're really done with anything deep now. Okay. So, so now we're just gonna put a few stitches in and put a dressing on this, oh. and you'll leave this in for five six days. Okay. okay. So yeah, did okay. sting a little bit. Yeah. So five or six days. Okay. Yeah. So you're gonna want to come back like on Tuesday of next week. This is Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, no, Wednesday. Wednesday. Okay. Yeah, Wednesday would be good. And we'll uh, take these stitches out for you. Okay. All right. Now I've got my sutures. I know. It's like on fire. I can't open it. Is it burning a little yeah. bit now? Okay. <laughs> I didn't feel anything until now. I was like, oh. She got the tiniest suture in the place here for you. <laughs> yeah, I think. Need a bigger one? No, no. We're fine. We're fine. Yeah, we're having a little boy. Oop, I got. The, I think I touched the camera. Can you it's check fine. it? Is it okay? Yeah. A little boy. A little boy. Chandler Jack. Chandler oh. Jack. <laughs> I love it. Chandler That's... Chandler Wade. Jack. What? <laughs> Is any family names in there? No. No. We tried that. It just didn't work out. Yeah, we did that. <laughs> And the last one, we were just like, forget. What, what are we? Yeah. <laughs> what have we not used in the family? He'd be upset once he on the playground playing and stuff, and people were making fun of him. Yeah. <laughs> I wanted Jackson. Oh, Jack. we have a Jackson. Do you? Mm -hmm. I, my grandfather was Jack, so I, that's what I wanted. And my husband did. Jackson. Was it? I love it. But now there's, you know. <laughs> tons. What? Your grandfather wasn't Rocky, like Rocky and Bullwinkle, Squirrel. Oh, sorry. I had, no. a little, I had to get a little squirrel in there. <laughs> You'll be here all week. <laughs> I 
thought it was good. That was good. Very good. <laughs> Gummy Jane, a little cut for me. Okay, I think you're going to have a very minimal scar. All right. I really do. I think this well, came together nicely. You saw the massive one to the on the inside. <laughs> it's nasty. Oh, the one on I've the had back that of, one since high school. The back of the knee? No, on the inner thigh. The I inner walked thigh? through one of those. Oh, the, a scar? Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. I didn't see those on the sidewalk, and I walked literally through it, and it yeah. just cut me. And I never got stitches for it. it may bubble a little bit. Let's put a little pressure on it. You really are going to have a divot here. I mean, oh. this this was. I mean, there was a so lot of material. So now we're going in opposite material. direction. <laughs> well, it'll it'll eventually fill in. Oh, okay. It'll granulate in on its own. It'll no, fill in. That's fine. Yeah, but but I have enough little dips in my leg. My yeah, thighs. I mean, were all bad. of this area in here had cyst underneath it, and and it was just full of all that. Uh, oh, wow. I think it was. I think it'd been there a lot longer, maybe than before you first recognized it. Yeah. Because it was. Because it was a little one, and then it just it like in the past few, it just really like. Yeah. Popped up. Well, Squirrel, you're awesome. Thanks for letting us video your procedure yeah, for all our for friends on YouTube. Thanks for doing this for me. I appreciate yeah. it. That you was do painless. To, you do have to sign a consent for me. Absolutely. And uh, then we'll be able to show it. Got that. All right. All right. So uh, we're gonna Gummy Jean's gonna dress it up for you, and then okay. we'll see you back next week. Okay. Sounds good. All right. Bye bye. Okay. So you've been taking Coco Skin. Been taking Coco Skin and uh, Meta Seven Wonderful. for probably a year and a half now. Okay. Love them both. I highly recommend them. My skin is great. I feel moisturized i I'm, they're wonderful take your hat off for me oh. i want everybody to see how pretty your skin is my hair is oily oh your hair is wonderful so have you noticed that you've lost some crow's feet or anything like that in particular or a little bit a little yeah a little bit okay all right because you do look like I mean, you you're glowing almost you have a real natural look about you so well wonderful i'm glad you're liking the coca skin and the meta 7. I take them both highly mm. recommend it thanks <laughs> Make sure to check out Coco Skin Plus for thicker nails, healthier skin, and better hair. And check out Meta 7 for more energy throughout the day. There are Amazon links in the description below. Do you love Dr. Gilmore's cyst bursting, pimple popping, and infection draining videos? Want to see the extended procedures with never before seen footage, early releases, and no ads? Then support us on Patreon for dozens of HD ad free videos. And don't worry, you can still watch on YouTube for free. But if you want the premium content with no ads, become a patron on Patreon. There's a link in the description. Hey folks, are you wondering how to boost your immune system to help protect yourself in cold and flu season? Well, maybe it's time for you to stack up on Meta 7. Meta 7 ingredients like B12 and B6 are the building blocks to a healthy immune system. In fact, according to health.com, vitamin B12 is a powerhouse. It helps make DNA, nerve and blood cells, and is crucial for a healthy brain and immune system. So if you're over 50, don't eat a balanced diet, or suffer from fatigue and could use a nice boost, then try Meta 7 today. Meta 7, I've got more energy. Uh, I feel good. I don't have any aches and pains like I usually have. And I notice just more energy with them. Since I spend more energy and more energetic, mm -hmm. I sleep better. So it's been a pretty good product for me. Notice a huge, tremendous energy boost. The four hours were really sluggish. I didn't want to do anything, even my work. It showed it, but now since I've been on it, my work is getting completed. Check out the Amazon links in the description below, and you can order today with Amazon Prime.